Hi, I am Roxana from VP Estate and in this video I will show how to manage listing reviews in VP Rentals team. In the team, the guest will be able to rate a listing after the booking period will be completed and also admin can post reviews. First, I will show how the guest can rate the listing after the booking is completed. I will log in as a guest and in my reservation section the guest will be able to see his bookings and also will be able to place reviews. I have here two bookings, one that has passed, this one, and another one with booking dates in the future. You can see that for the booking that passed you will have the post review button and for the future booking you will have you can post the review after the trip. If this button will be pressed nothing will happen but if the guest will press post review he will be able to rate this listing. Here you will be able to set the number of stars for each category. I will select 5 stars for all and here the guest will be able to add a message. I will add a message as well and I will click submit review. You can see that now the post review button does not display anymore and if you go on the listing page the review will be displayed. This is how the guest will manage reviews. Next, I will show how admin can manage them. I will next log in as admin. The admin can delete, edit or see reviews from the comment section. He will be able to change the number of stars and edit the text. Also, the admin can add reviews on behalf of his guests. And next, I will show the exact steps that admin will need to take. First, the admin will need to create a new user from front end register form. That user will need to have the username that will be displayed as the review name. I will create the user account. I will log in. Next, I will go to the admin dashboard and change this user level to administrator. So I will go to users. I will edit the new user and here I will change the level to administrator. I will save the change. I will go back to the new user account on refresh the new user will have admin level i will go to admin and i will edit the listing where the admin wants to add the new review i will click edit and i will add a new comment i will add it here and press add comment next i will go to comments section i will edit the review that i added i will add the number of stars I will save the changes made and if I open the listing the review will show with the new username the last step is to go back to the main admin account and switch the user account back to subscriber. I will save the changes. These are the steps that admin needs to take to add reviews manually. Next, I will show how owners can provide a reply for the reviews received for their properties. The owner reply will be visible under the review here. The owners can provide replies to the reviews from user dashboard. So I will go user dashboard. Here you'll have my reviews section. This option will be available for team versions higher than 3.10. The my reviews page will be imported along with the demo content, but if you do not have it, you will need to manually create it. To create this page, you will need to go to pages, add a new page, add title, select the user dashboard my reviews template. I will not save this page because I already have it in my site, so I will go back to user dashboard. The owner will find here all the reviews made for his properties. The owner will need to type here his reply and press the reply to review button. The reply will be visible in the listing page. 
This wraps our video. Thank you for watching and do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get instant notifications on new videos.